Hello everyone, I'm Jim and this is Gardening Through the Seasons Inside and Outdoors. I would like to show you today and also taste uh, a fruit from a very unusual pepper plant that comes from southern Brazil. It's called Flexosum and it has small peppers and we will discover the flavor of them in a moment. But what makes this so amazing is it is a cold hardy pepper. Check out the flowers and stuff. A cold hardy pepper, the only one that I know that's this cold, it can take, uh, or can stand this cold. It can take frost, ice, and uh, sprout again in the spring. Amazing. And one thing I found about it, this is actually a year old plant. Of all the peppers I've grown, it has done the best long-term in a pot. I've grown it a little on the dry side, and it's just, look, it's a beautiful little plant. Other pepper plants, when I try to grow them, they grow really well at first and get big in a pot, and then they kind of fizzle out. But this one, it just, it seems the right proportions, and it just seems to like growing in a pot very well and, and looking very attractive. All right, so what does it taste like? So here's the fruit. And I don't know if you can get kind of a size um, of it. It's not not very big. So I want to see if I can propagate. And if you have any uh, tips for me on propagating peppers from cuttings, let me know. Because this was difficult to start from seed. All right, let's get the flavor. Mmm. Mango. <clears throat> Coconut. Pineapple. Just kidding. I mostly get... <clears throat> Sorry guys, I mostly just get heat. Very respectable amount of heat. Uh, not as hot as a, a, um, a habanero or anything, but it does punch heat for something that size. Here's, here's one on the, on the plant. I really wanna propagate these and get a whole bunch of them outside. I think that they would uh, add to like a, a chicken dish or something. You could throw a few of them in and it would add a little punch to it little heat to it. Flexosum from Southern Brazil. Like my video, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.